Welcome back to Tom Badula TV and to the second segment of Program 3. Uh, we are in Murano, just outside of our experience uh, with the glass making. We actually see the products along the uh, waterside uh, shops of Murano and uh, we truly enjoy looking at the colourful pieces, uh, the magnificent atmosphere that they create both outside of the shops and inside. We are able to film some of the products and I hope you do enjoy this particular segment. Well this is Murano, the city of glass. The shop windows didn't disappoint because at least we get a, a feel of um, what can be made with glass and uh, also the masks um, and all the other items that they are on display. Absolutely beautiful. You can see a place like Murano and later Burano do depend on tourists to, to, for their livelihoods. Uh, and of course um, the products of the sea. So that's uh, lifestyle in Venice. Well, as we were walking along over the bridge, we turn around and we see a Murano funeral. We're witnessing a funeral here in Venice. Oh, that's why all the people are here. Huh? <coughs> that's why all these people are here. Obviously, the mass has just been just happened. Um, the coffin has been taken away from, on the boat. Even the bird is, uh, has stopped. Sign of respect.
these are some of the absolutely beautiful pieces that um, we admired, but we saw uh, even more of this type of work. Uh, of course, you can't film it all, so you'll have to go there <laughs> to Murano. Well, we're on our way to Burano, another island that needs tourists, famous for lace and embroidery. Well, that's it uh, in Murano, literally, except for uh, the view of the museum across uh, the bay in Murano and uh, the very typical Venetian uh, funeral where a deceased uh, person is being taken away in its last uh, boat ride, if you like. 